In this video, I focus on a client that recently got FDA approval for their investigational new drug application, the IND, using only mass spectrometry data for monitoring host cell proteins. As far as we know, this is the first example of regulatory authorities accepting an application without any ELISA data. This client develops a biopharmaceutical product from an unusual bacteria cell line for which there are no commercial ATP ELISA kits. So they either had to develop a process-specific assay or use an orthogonal method that does not rely on anti-ATP antibodies. After using our mass spectrometry assay for process optimization, they got a good understanding of the ATPs in their drug product. Therefore, the client decided to qualify the assay and to use it for IND submission. The assay qualification included the following parameters. Specificity, limit of detection, lower limit of quantitation, linearity and calibration curves, accuracy and precision. All parameters were met within the acceptance criteria. Here you see the intermediate precision, showing the amount in ppm of the 12 most abundant ATPs as well as the total amount of whole cell proteins. With the successful qualification, the client used the data for IND filing. This is a very good example of how you can use orthogonal method, not only to cut process development time, but also for regulatory documentation. If you want to see more of the data from this qualification project, I recommend my webinar on how to move LCMS ATP analysis into a GMP environment.